You're watching 8-Bit Days a Week, and I'm gonna be playing a very popular game popularized by Game Boy, I guess? Although it's not it didn't really originate from the Game Boy. And uh, if it does work, getting a blue screen here. Come on, you can do it. And looks like it doesn't work. Oh well, maybe if I try the other cores. And so sorry, I have to go through this. I'll try the 2003 plus experimental. And obviously from the file name this is Tetris and even though I keep on getting the warning that it's not working properly I'm hoping I might luck out but nope same thing and I have the 2000 core to try let's see if that works there come on no, oh, the FBA. Maybe it works on the Final Burn Alpha. Hmm. This doesn't even say that it's not working. It just brought me back to the uh, retro arc screen. All right, one last thing to try. So, if anyone's wondering. Oh, finally, it's working. <laughs> if anyone's wondering, this is the Sega version on the arcade. And um, I had fond memories of this one specifically because, yeah, this is my um, local. I think it was McDonald's. I'm not sure, I can't remember. Uh, yeah, I think it was McDonald's. Had this in the Street Fighter 2 cabinet. And as you'd imagine, the Street Fighter 2 cabinet is always full with lots of um, fighters lining up. And even though if I get my chance there, I'd get uh, whipped up pretty quick. So, you know, might as well play some other game. And this happened to be the other game there. So I'd spend my time playing this as well. I'm no expert though very rusty I did play um, the Puyo Puyo switch a lot but I'm not good there either oh come on oh no Terrible. No. <laughs> As you can see, I am terrible at decision making, split second decision making. And, um,. This uh, music actually is also in the Puyo Puyo Tetris. That's why I suddenly remembered, hey, there's a, there was an arcade. No, no, no. There was an arcade Tetris and I played it a lot. So I figured it must be this um, Sega version. Oh. 
And yeah, I actually... This is actually my first time running it. Hence, I didn't know which um, core to use earlier. So it doesn't work with um, MAME 2003. Or any MAME, MAME version. It worked on FBA, Final Burn Alpha. Maybe that should be my go-to MU, I mean core. Ah, this is the worst. fun while it lasted <laughs> I can't anymore I'm panicking so bad uh. all right anyway I could have made 30 lines at least but I'm pretty content with my first time replaying this game after I don't know how many years <laughs> And yeah, once again, this is Sega Tetris. I think this came out also for the Sega Mega Drive. This uh, specific version or was it slightly different I um I haven't really played that I just know that there was a Tetris that exists on the uh, Sega Mega Drive I would have thought it's this version I mean it's from Sega admire all those Tetris masters that are able to play this game without cracking under pressure. Also leads me to question so to anyone that also you know plays arcade games uh, via RetroArch what's your go-to core for you know arcade titles is it uh, MAME I mean MAME or do you use FBA Final Burn Alpha I uh, normally use the FBA for, you know, Neo Geo, CPS2. Everything else is usually... Um, what the... 
Uh, uh, everything else is usually um, the MAME multiple arcade machine emulator. Hey, it slowed down again. That's weird. Time to breathe, I guess. Oh, mistake. Mistake! I had... What's up with the straight lines? gives you what you want when you don't need it. I'm not risking it. serious this game is <laughs> this game is broken <laughs> I mean what was that oh no I can't even move my um, blocks fast enough oh come on See, I cannot even get it there in time. Alright, this is it. <laughs> it's been fun. And, uh, oh yeah. So Sega Tetris works on uh, using the FBA 2012 core on your PlayStation Classic. There are other... I mean, there's a lot of Tetris versions out there, so you might want to try them as well. I just had some personal nostalgic value for this one. That's why I chose this specific version. And you're watching 8-bit days a week. Um, thanks for watching.